Well, good evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too and uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific, a crackling atmosphere. The match, I think, will be quite a spectacle. This, of course, one of the most recognisable venues in the Netherlands, perhaps the whole of the continent. It is the Johan Cruyff Arena. Who do you reckon is pivotal? Yeah, Kevin De Bruyne. He's just one of the best strikers of the ball you'll ever see. And that applies just as much to his passing game as it does to his shooting prowess. He generally likes to keep things simple, taking as few touches as possible, but making every one of them count. I've got a feeling he's going to be a real handful for the opposition here. Yes, getting the best out of him will count for so much. So it's down to business here. Meunier. Tielemans. And it's Meunier. De Bruyne. And he's there to cut it out. Chirkov. Golovin. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Tielemans. Alderweireld. Denier. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Torgan Azar. Alderweireld. Tielemans. And here's Lukaku. Azar. Dinks one in. Defending of the desperate variety. Hit long and direct. And the ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Turns and goes back. Russia are playing with a pleasing wit. Has a hit! And here's Zhirkov. Incoming cross, and the shot! Oh, that probably deserved better. I have to commend the wing play, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Aldevera drives it forward. Get a throw in. Meunier. Witzel. Belgium so far providing no real test at all for the goalkeeper. And it's Azar. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Golovin hoists it forward. A heavy challenge. Out for a throw.
Tielemans. Meunier. Witzel. Alderweireld. And it's played forward. Alderweireld needed to come up with a better ball. Oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. Tielemans. Tielemans not easily shrugged off the ball. Meunier. Witzel. And here's Lukaku. Tielemans. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Shirkov. Kudryashov. Shirkov. Kudryashov. Golovin. Forward it goes. And that is as far as they're going to go. Meunier. De Bruyne. Tielemans. Just brushed off the ball there. Shirkov. Plays it out to the wing. And that's the end of that. It all started well enough. Looks to clip it forward. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. Golovin. And he's shown him a clean pair of heels. Aldebera very firm in standing his ground there. It is a tough full contact contest. It's Lukaku! Goal! Belgium! First blood drawn. Really outwitted one on one. Once more, he gets the better of the keeper. Yeah, that's brilliant from him. Such a, a calm finish. Just pick your spot, don't think about what the keeper's going to do, concentrate on what you have to do. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, just listen to the reaction, I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. Belgium are in control here on the brink of half-time. Out towards the flank. He's gone for it! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Still a cracking effort. Really looked like a man on a mission the way he went through on goal. Tielemans. Aldebera plays it forward. Tielemans. Tielemans with the crossfield ball. Breakthrough came in the final moments of the first period, and it's 1-0. Torgan Azar. Tielemans. De Bruyne. He's there to receive it. Lukaku! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely. And that is going to be the final action of the first half. And here we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal, which is very, very tight.
I'm sure they'll be very happy with the first half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain the momentum now and finish the job. Belgium head into the dressing room, pleased with the thought that they have that all-important lead. Analysis to come during the break. And we're off again. Well, 1 0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. And there's a long ball. Tries to massive lead! Good delivery, no joy. Ziuba really could have done with putting that away. He was up like the proverbial salmon. The Tongan tries to get it forward quickly. Witzel. For Tongan. Tielemans, De Bruyne. Kudryashov. Jikia. He's got away. Azar. Denier. Witzel. Team still separated by the game's only goal. Aldevera gets it back. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Witzel plays it long, knocks it away. Kudryashov plays it forward. Yeah, that's top defending in preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. <laughs> Russia showing a little more urgency now, and to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Just has to be done. Tielemans plays it out to the flank. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? Jikia. Jim, what are you thinking? Well, Peter, if they're attempting to see out the game with such a, a narrow advantage, there's room for trouble. Uh, I just think they're sending out the wrong... Well, that's surely a foul free kick. The ball stands firm, and it's bounced out. Lukaku has made his mark on this game. Golovin battles to win it back. Gets wrestled off the ball. De Bruyne. Jikia. Golovin. Almost 75 minutes on the clock now. This is quite a run, and he's not done yet. In for a header! Oh, not the best of headers.
Tielemans. It's come loose. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. And the through ball is intercepted. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. And here's Shekhov. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. For Tongan. De Bruyne. 1-0 as we head towards the end. Hoists it forward. He's got options out wide. Torgan Azar gets into some space. Gets up to Hennett! They've scored! And that should do it! Within sight of the finish line. Belgium produced a lovely sequence of passes there. It's a terrific brand of football to watch. And importantly, it is a strong end product. His second of the game. And an eye now for the hat trick. Time for a change in personnel. Yeah, it's about time I think we saw some activity from the bench, but it's it's debatable as to what level of impact can be made from here. It's it's pretty late. Belgium could not have picked a better time to snatch a two-goal lead. Is there still time for a response? Well, some fans are already on their way out, so that to me says everything, Peter. And it's Mertens. Golovin. Kutryashov. And it's played forward. De Bruyne, and the weighted pass. Good ball. Chikia cuts it out. And that will be the final act. Belgium in victory here, and on balance they were worth it. And after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? There's a solidity about them, almost as if they set up not to lose and see how things unfold. That is the pressure on the strikers, who can afford to be patient, and it's all paid off. My thanks to Jim alongside me, and as the fans make their way home, so must we. Good evening to you.